What's up everybody? It's Logan. Hello. Um doing a video right now. Actually I was been thinking about it about uh showing exactly what I'm doing for um my nipples and changing the dressings on them and everything. Um this is more towards educational um information for like other guys and binary people maybe that uh have gotten top surgery and they're just looking to maybe see what I've done and maybe if you know, kinda get some ideas for prep work ahead of time of what they'll need for supplies and things like that. Um, so I just got out of the shower not too long ago, nice and clean, make sure your hands are clean. So what I have is actually um, a kit that my friend Kyle got for me, um, one second. This is the tea kits, yeah. It's, and I know it's made specifically for people like me who've gotten top surgery. Um, and it has a whole bunch of stuff in it. You can look it up online, tkits.com, I believe it is. Um, but for me right now, um, I also got the sensitive skin one because I think the tape, I was thinking ahead of time the tape was uh, not going to be as harsh um, for changing everything, which I'm really glad we went with. Thank you, Kyle. You're fucking awesome. <laughs> Best birthday present besides surgery. Um, so these, I normally use these. I'm currently out. There was three boxes of these in there. Um, there's 10 per per box, but you use one per each side. So um, I have to do this until 27th. So instead of going to buy new ones, um, they did give me these after they pulled my drains out. So, and what they basically look like is like this but another half to it. I already pre-cut them, um, so I figured instead of going to the store and buying more of those for only two more days now, I could just cut these up and use these. Free, right? Because I got a stack of them and I haven't had to use them, but I think I used them for maybe two days just to um, help with the, the stuff that was coming out still after they pulled the drains out, so we're good. Um, so yeah, I have that set up over here already. Um, I have the, the tape. All right, scissors, obviously you'll need those. Um, and then you get prescribed, well you, from, yeah, you get prescribed it, I guess, technically, but you go and get your prescription for the zero form stuff. And that's what I'm doing. Um, it looks yellow, it's really sticky and gooey and gross. But I'm gonna go ahead and do this now and then just kind of show you as I'm doing it, what it looks like. And usually, I'm actually playing music in the background all the time. So, it's really weird doing this in a very quiet apartment. Kind of weird. Super, super weird. These are not going to look pretty, but that's okay. We don't need them to look pretty, we just need them to do a little job. So I'm going to put this over my nip. Like that. Boom, good to go. Leave it. Get some for the next one. Probably should have pre-cut this. I mean, I had everything else figured out, but not that. It's all right. Kind of make this a little smaller. Don't really need a whole lot, just enough to cover the nip. A little extra, that's okay. But yeah, here we go on each side. Good to go. Cool. Next step. Do this up. Put these bad boys on over it. So, put this one about here. Just because I don't want to have the tape too close to the incision on either side. So, that's how I do it. Sometimes I can get it. If I tilt back a little bit and go like this, I know it's weird, but it'll kind of stick on because, again, that zero form stuff is kind of gooey and sticky and gross. But it's okay. Gonna keep that. It's kind of a long 
piece of tape, whatever. Put this in here. Flatten that. Boom. That's done. Nice, easy. I like it. Um, I know some guys do use um, Neosporin or something like that to put on the nipple first and then whatever else, but every doctor has different instructions. These were the instructions that I were given. I asked if I could put Neosporin or should put Neosporin on beforehand because it does come with the kit as well. Um, and they told me no. Just to the zero form which I'm guessing is the smart way to go anyway because it is a uh, technical like prescription for the pharmacy in order to get it so there's probably stuff in there already that helps you with healing All right, almost done it's taking longer than I thought boom done yeah, alright, last step is putting on this fun thing. And then as of Tuesday, I won't have to do this anymore. We're hoping. We'll see. What we gotta do use the camera here as a little bit of a mirror. Sometimes if you leave a little too much on the top or the bottom, it'll scratch against you and be uncomfortable. You don't want that. They told me to make sure I had it, the strap part on the side, and that that's all that they required of that. I don't know why, but they were pretty adamant about that being on the side. So, And that is my process for the day. Once every day since they told me to start doing this on June 8th. Um, for the nipple stuff. Alrighty. Thanks guys. I just wanted to put that out there and hopefully it's uh, useful for somebody in the future. Alrighty. Have a great day. Love you guys. Peace. Half heart.